Hello my friends, my name is Paul, Oscar Mike Zero Echo Tango. Firstly, thank you very much for purchasing my homemade ultra light magnetic loop antenna. In this video I will show you how to very easy assemble, use and disassemble this small ultra light magnetic loop. Also I want to say uh, something about this antenna. Uh, do not exceed more than 15 or 20 watts on this antenna. I was testing this antenna by 20 watts also, but the antenna works on 20 watts only on 40 meters and only on 30 meter bands. On the upper bands is the antenna guaranteed by 10 watts max. So please use the antenna only with 10 watts or 20 watts on lower bands. That's it, and now uh, let's go to show you how this antenna works. So the first step how to use this antenna is to buy a common fishing tripod stand. I use this fishing tripod stand and uh, there are many others on the eBay, for example. And uh, every uh, tripod stand for fishing use the same screw. You see here, the antenna is attached by this uh, a screw, capable to fit into this into this uh, tripod stand. So, screw or attach the uh, lower or the bottom part of the antenna to the tripod stand. Fix it. You have got in the package a two clutches. The first clutch, please pull on top of the bottom part of the ultralight magnetic loop. This is the middle part of the magnetic loop antenna. The middle part is attached by the uh, RG58 coaxial cable with two BNC connectors on both sides. The middle part of the antenna attached on the clutch between bottom part and top part of the antenna. Push, push the uh, pipe inside as more as possible. And now I'm going to fit the uh, top part of the uh, ultralight magnetic loop on this construction. Please use the second clutch on top of the middle part of the antenna. Now you have got uh, the uh, uh, top part of the antenna with this uh, plastic holder and also with the uh, uh, plastic cover. You see how it works. The plastic holder is fixed to this pipe. Slide down the uh, plastic holder. Now attach this small loop inside the plastic holder. Click the coupler box to the pipe. Now it's okay and do not cover the plastic holder. Not yet. Attach the uh, top part of the antenna on the boom and push. Connect the uh, RG58 feed line to the coupler box. Antenna is almost complete. Now we have to attach the uh, mine loop for the antenna. The mine loop consists of these three parts. Firstly, Attach the uh, mine loop coaxial uh, cable on the antenna 
inside the uh, plastic holder. As you can see here in the middle, in the middle of this cable, you see the marking that this is the middle part of this loop. This middle part should be attached inside the plastic holder, there on the boom. And now it's time to attach the uh, plastic cover. Again, slide up the plastic cover on the plastic holder. Attach this uh, tuning box right on the bottom of the uh, first clutch on the pipe and click. This is the right place how to mount, where to mount the uh, tuning box. The second part is to attach the uh, mine loop coaxial cable inside the box. Hold the one part of the coaxial in one hand and with the second hand screw the coax. Also the same on the other direction, on the other side of the tuning box. Okay. When the mag loop has been completed and finished, now it's time to make a perfect cycle of this mind loop coaxial cable. Try to create the cycle the best as you can. Antenna will look nicer of course, but it will it will not make much effect on the uh, on work of this antenna. And now the ultralight magnetic loop is ready to work and we can go to turn on my transceiver. Connect the antenna to your transceiver. Turn it on. And uh, desire your uh, favorite band for example, 40 meters. Okay, and now we have to find with the uh, button on the uh, bottom of the uh, tuning box, we have to turn this button, button until you will hear some noise peak. You see? Then you hear some voices, noise peak, right now you can right now you can uh, tune precisely your antenna. Switch to mode FM, Push the uh, PTT button and watch here the SWR. You see, the left side is the power, the right side is the SWR. This is the best spot what I found. Antenna is tuned properly on the frequency 7.200. And now we can go working DX. 
Please never transmit when you don't hear any any uh, peak of the noise because you can damage your transmitter. It's very uh, dangerous because of the high SWR on the antenna. Band is very empty today. Okay guys, so hope you enjoyed this video and I wish you good luck with your new uh, ultralight magnetic loop antenna. Hope to hear you on the band 73. Bye bye.